Hello, and welcome to A Moment in Black History. Valerie Thomas, born in the United States in 1943, she was always fascinated by science and math. Unfortunately, the school she attended didn't encourage her interest in those fields. So Miss Thomas would have to pursue these interests outside the school system. After graduating from high school, Miss Thomas finally got a chance to explore her interests when she attended Morgan State University in Baltimore, Maryland. She chose the field of physics as her major and was one of only two women at Morgan State in that field. Miss Thomas excelled in her studies, and after graduation, she accepted a position as a data analyst at the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, better known as NASA. During her career at NASA, she held a number of positions, including Project Manager of SPAN, which is the Space Physics Analysis Network, and she was the Associate Chief of Space Science Data Operations, which is the permanent archive for NASA's space science mission data and space science physics data. Ms. Thomas also helped develop large-scale experiments, computer data systems, and in the 1970s, one of her enduring legacies was managing the image processing systems for Landsat, which was the first satellite to send real-time digital images directly from outer space to controllers at NASA. And in 1980, Ms. Thomas would receive a patent for the illusion transmitter, which is basically a device that would simulate a real-time three-dimensional viewing of an object through optical illusions with parabolic mirrors. The device produces optical illusion images via two concave mirrors. Concave mirrors create images that appear to be real or in front of the mirror itself. NASA still uses this technology that Ms. Thomas developed to this day and it has since been adapted for use in surgery as well as in the production of television and video screens. Ms. Thomas has also helped to develop computer program designs that supported research on Halley's Comet, the ozone layer, and satellite technology. For her achievements, Ms. Thomas received a number of NASA awards including the Goddard Space Flight Center Award of Merit and the NASA Equal Opportunity Medal. She worked for NASA from 1964 to 1995 and then retired. Valerie Thomas contributed greatly to the study of space.